Hi guys, it's your girl Natalie, the One True Diamond, coming at you with Monday Morning Chit Chat. It's Monday, the beginning of the week, a fresh week, a fresh week, a fresh start. I'm going to quit saying, mm, Monday time to go back to work. It's a fresh week, a fresh start. It's Monday, yes. <laughs> and my week is so uneventful. When I did my planner this week, I had nothing going on this week. And that's not a bad thing. Don't get me wrong. It's not a bad thing. And I'm like, I don't even know. Like, okay, I don't even know if I'm on coupon this week or not. Might just take a break and continue to organize my inserts. You guys, my car was in such a mess. So I took all the inserts out. I still got some loose mess in here. I got to get up and out of the floor. Um, and then taking them back and it out and everything, but I'm getting around to that But right now I'm trying to clip these inserts and put these things in my binder And I'm gonna try to keep it up like that Like I'm gonna try to scale back on how many inserts I've been purchasing because I don't like clip inserts and I just don't like to clip them and the whole inserts just gets cumbersome because you get digging through them looking for coupons and then you just and sometimes it seems easier because you can kind of figure out where the coupon is and get that insert but if you don't if you don't have any organization with it it becomes cumbersome because you got to dig through all the inserts just to get to the one that you want to get to so yeah so I um I'm gonna try to go back to clipping and what I did was the ones that I had an enormous amount I clipped like the majority of them and I've set like maybe um, five of them five to six maybe it's according to how many I got for that week I sat to the side I said I'm not gonna clip this many um, I will just save them and if I need it I can go back and get them the ones that are about to expire I am not clipping those I'm just leaving them in the plastic things and I went through and looked I picked out the ones that I thought that I was more than likely use because sometimes do y'all get clipping and say I would never purchase this and that's how I be I, I, I'm like that when I'm clipping something I'm like I'll never purchase it but it, it's on a page and I don't want a bunch of loose pages everywhere so I go ahead and clip it and put it in the binder knowing goodness doggone well I'm never going to buy that item but then again you don't want to throw the coupon away because you never know when something out of the blue might pop up and it becomes a money maker or give you some overage on something so I just I still hang on to it but you just never know yeah so that's what I spent yesterday evening doing was um, trying to get those clipped and organized and I still got a ways to go but I did make a dent. I made some progress. So I'm very pleased with the progress that I did make. And I'm going to work on some tonight. I don't think my inserts for this week will be here today. They don't normally come this quick. Because she usually mail. Like if I get them from one girl. on Like order them on Wednesday. I'll have them by Friday. But she didn't put her post up or even respond back to me till late. So... I didn't order from her. I ordered from someone that I used to order from. Um, I, I, I flip flop in between people that I order from. So, and she mailed them out Saturday. So, I won't get them until probably Tuesday, maybe Wednesday. You know, so, yeah. But I'm not stressing because I really don't. I'm not into, I don't feel like really couponing. Now, I did go out and try to get the game deal, I scoped it out Saturday. There was gain pods, Todd pods on the shelf, and I thought I was going to be, which I was the first one there, because I got there a little after 9, and the store was not open. It didn't open to 10. So I made the mistake of leaving and going to Food Lion and do my little groceries and come back. It was like 8 minutes after 10, and I can tell you that shelf was clear. It was three ladies in there. One was already at the counter with hers. One was around the corner with hers in the cart. The other lady come around, passed me by, had some in the cart. I'm like, okay. So y'all got the pods in the um, front me that I had already scoped out. Oh, God. But it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I, um, 
I just missed, I was able to get the liquid gain. It wasn't um, cheap as the pods were, but I got the liquid gain. And then I um, got two bags of Tide Pods, not realizing that it was going to leave me two cents shy of getting my 700 points. So now I have to go back and buy like two little CoverGirl eyeshadows so that I can get my 700 points um, with that. So, yeah. Because I got a coupon for, I think it's $2 off of two. So I hope I can find some cheap ones. Those little eyeshadow things were on clearance at one point or another. I don't know if they still are or not, but maybe I can find some clearance ones or not. I'm going to see what I come up with because if they're still... I don't know if they're on sale, but I won't get 150%. I don't know. Sometimes they don't sell like that. I'm not sure. I won't know till I actually get in the store to actually see what the price is. So, yeah, I might just buy one and just chalk it up. I know. <laughs> and, of course, the coupon expired yesterday. So, if there is some pods in these stores by my job, then, which I know there's not. I know there's not. So, I'm not even going to worry about trying to do that. So, it'll be a cover girl eyeshadow or something that I might want. Okay. Um, that's a part of that deal. I got to look at the paper and see. It is cold out here, you guys. It's been flooding everywhere. And, yeah. Okay, truck. Come on. Come on. This little truck got out in front of me. Can't nobody break my stride. Can't nobody hold me down. Oh no. <laughs> I got to keep on moving. <laughs> Woo! I got to keep on moving because I'm. Um, I, let me tell y'all. I like when I get off early. I like my 5 30 days. But that means I have to be to work at 9 o'clock. And I'm pushing it all the time. Really pushing it today because. I'm like, by golly, I got to get my workout in in the mornings because even though I done workouts yesterday afternoon, I did do a workout yesterday. I will do it, but I prefer to get mine done in the morning and out of the way. Today is day 39 of Fit to Love Me 100 Challenge. We're going strong. We're boop, 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 boop. Yes, almost 40 days. One more day for 40 days. 40 days. Yes, Jesus fasted 40 days and 40 nights. <laughs> okay, I know y'all like this. You're stupid right now, okay? <laughs> it's Monday. Did I tell y'all it's Monday? Yeah, and there's nothing in here but Dunkin' Donuts. But, um... Yeah, day 39, 50, love me, 100. You guys, I am so happy. I got on the scale this morning. I am down to 219.8. Oh, I can smell Wonderland. Y'all like, okay, honey, that's 20 pounds. <laughs> oh, y'all know how I psych myself up. I told y'all I psyched myself up to get to the next big thing. But I'm still super stoked because when I look back, when I weighed in at the beginning of this challenge, I was 228.2. And I am 219. That is almost 10 pounds weight loss. Oh, God. I'm sorry, you guys, but y'all know what? I'm not editing. I'm not editing. <laughs> Woo. Yeah. So yeah so um so yeah that's almost 10 pounds since we started so i'm excited almost a 10 pound loss whoop, whoop. gotta keep pushing and when i see stuff like that it makes me motivated it gets me pumped it makes me want to work out even harder it makes me want to stay focused on what i'm doing and eating so yeah it encourages me so y'all we need to take every little win like every even a non-scale victory because that will even help you keep pushing because it's like in my uniforms now usually you know i know i say i feel tight and swollen in them yeah it feels loose and the thing about it is i ordered some more uniforms 
y'all, if y'all need uniforms, and I'm just gonna say if you're in North Carolina, <laughs> they ship everywhere though. Don't get me wrong, they ship everywhere. They're called duckscrubs.com. They're not expensive, they're plain, they're not the fancy things, they're plain, but they're not expensive. Like a uniform top is ten dollars, the bottom is ten dollars, and a lab jacket is eleven dollars. That's a good price. If you go in the uniform stores, you know you are paying anywhere from 20, you're paying 20, 20, and 20 is being good about it. You're paying anywhere from, I'm going to say 25 on up for some nice uniforms. But these are pretty decent quality. They sew them there at the factory and they sell them. And they're called Duck Scrubs. And this, the website is duckscrubs.com. And, and D U C K S C R U B. Exactly what I'm saying. Duck, like a duck, quack, quack duckscrubs.com and I'm telling you guys I ordered these uniforms Thursday around probably about 10, 30-ish, 11 o'clock and they were at my door Friday morning with those uniforms that is the quickest I have ever, but like I said I'm in North Carolina, but that's the quickest I have ever received a ship and I'm like these people were on it, either they weren't busy or they got an overachiever working there um, or something <laughs> but I was happy to see that. I did not um, do a haul video or show them because they're like just plain black scrubs. They ain't nothing exciting. So, yeah. And they do have like the low rider ones if you like the hip hugger type ones with the flare legs. They do have those type, but I, um, Fatty Patty Billy ain't ready for those yet. <laughs> I gotta have something up over. I got the nose up on my belly. I just gotta know that it's on this belly. So yeah, I ain't ready for that, but just wait. This body will be ready. <laughs> so yeah, and um so talking about the weight loss. Now you guys, I am super, super excited. I have been on YouTube. I am since this water is really rising long here oh goodness since um i've been on youtube since 2010 i started out doing my natural hair videos in 2010 and i have finally <laughs> can you say it finally hit a thousand subscribers Woo yes i am super hyped up i hit a thousand subscribers so i have got to come up with a giveaway i don't know what i'm gonna do i gotta think about it i, I don't know I, I talked about it um in my videos previously that when i hit a thousand subscribers i was going to do a giveaway so yeah so now i have hit a thousand subscribers and I want to do a giveaway so I've got to decide what I'm going to be doing and then I will let you guys know and I'll let you know the rule contest rules now I don't know about I don't know if I have any international people I don't know about shipping international y'all because y'all know that's expensive don't like to leave anybody out but I don't know maybe we can figure out something I'm not sure what it costs to ship international. I, I don't know. I know it's expensive because I had shipped some things international before and it was not cheap. So I don't know if it would even be worth <laughs> shipping international. But anyway, I do appreciate you too if y'all have any. I don't know if I do or not. But anyway, um, I got to decide what I'm going to do. And what the giveaway is. I don't know. I want to think of something good. Something one true diamond-ish. <laughs> Y'all like, oh Lord, never mind. I don't want to enter. <laughs> but tell her what she might do. So anyway, my time is running out, you guys. But thank you so much for sticking with me and my channel. To my faithful few, I already told you guys. I want to do something special for just my faithful few who follow all the time and you know that subscribe that listens and to those of you who've been responding or replying I can't reply to you because I don't know where you are I don't know if you're in the Google thing I don't know but I want to reply to your comments but I can't find you 
So I'm sorry about that. Please forgive me. Y'all give God his praise. Give him his thanks. See you in the next video. Bye.